right, so The Little Mermaid is 2023. So um, you have Haley Bailey, uh, or Halle Bailey, um, as as Ariel in this live action. I'm honestly most excited because Melissa McCarthy is Ursula, and it's <laughs> Melissa McCarthy. So how's she gonna <laughs> um, trip underwater? I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I don't know. Maybe we'll see her on land because that does happen in a brief period in the cottage. So, I don't know. It's going to be hilarious. She's the first one, so. <laughs> Yeah, she's got a trip somehow. She's got a tri- she's got to be goofy. Trip, um, fall over something. Right. The music should be really good. I mean, we saw uh, the trailer um, for uh, part of that part of the A New World or whatever the name of the song is. Um, part of that world. Um, so, I think that'll be good. Um, the casting seems pretty spot. Lin Manuel Miranda's involved, so it's going to be catchy. There's going to be some hits here. Um, Under the Sea, I'm ready for that. I don't know what they have in store, but I'm, re- I'm here for it. Um, so I think that'll be a really good film as well. Yeah. Um, even though this is real life, I think they should add a cartoonish mm. flavor to it because, especially underwater. Because it looks really dark. And, yes, uh, I don't know how they'll do that. That I think that's the only thing for me. Afraid it would be too serious, or no, no. I meant the lighting. I, I'm not Just talking really about the lighting. But, yeah, it looks too dark under the sea. I mean, that's real. That's real life. But you you need a little bit of cartoonish stuff in there because am I going to be able to see the fish dancing around? Um, are they gonna be fish dancing? We don't know. <laughs> oh, what's the point? What, what are we doing here? <laughs> well, I mean, you were the Lion King. Yeah, and they could have added a more cartoonish perspective on it. I think that would have helped. So I think we know what to expect. We, we we've seen the to be disappointed. To to be uh, to remember that this is not our childhood this was not intended to be a replacement well they, so they like making the money they, <laughs> yes um but I, I i don't know i don't i don't expect it to be as goofy uh, i'm curious to see how that cgi is going to look with flounder and sebastian in particular um because they'll be in a good bit of the movie i imagine it will be pretty sad if flounder and sebastian look like a flounder and a crab um, so I Still do hope you're right. There is, I hope there is some <laughs> creativity because if we get realism like Pumbaa, this is not going to be that fun to watch. That's what I'm talking about. You need that car, sh- that cartoonish aspect to it. Like right. it, it can't be just straight real life. Yeah, Sebastian needs lips. Right? <laughs> and crabs don't have those in real life. So. Imagine that fish trying to talk. <laughs> looking flat and mouth just going up and down not not really matching what he's saying will they make them people or like different kinds of mer people instead of a fish and a crab maybe yeah, I mean humanoid. I'm not against it I mean that, that's a part that's of a making an adaptation point. right thanks for watching and if you would like to be featured on our podcast Make sure to click the link in the description.